Dexter will be your patient when placing the bite wing instrument. The only thing about Dexter is his thick rubber tongue that can get in the way, so be sure that you are maneuvering that out of the way for him. Unlike a real patient, he's unable to move that. We have a handle that closes and opens Dexter's jaw. You simply bring it back and it will lock closed. Push it forward and his jaw will stay open. When placing your bite wing instrument, you're always going to start with your premolar bite wing first on your patient. And you're going to make sure that you're placing this between the tongue and the dentition. Again, make sure you move Dexter's tongue out of the way. Make sure that you're pushing your bite block midline or to the middle of the patient's mouth and that your black phosphor plate is parallel to your premolars. When placing a premolar bite wing, make sure you bring it as far forward as you can to the front edge of the sensor hits the front of the patient's mouth and have the patient close. You're going to slide the ring forward so it's about an inch from the patient's face, never up against their face. And you're going to turn the end of your tube so that it, the orientation of the collimator matches the orientation of your phosphor plate and that the tube is nice and flush with the ring and your notches are aligned.